Hello, I'm Catherine Armstrong and I'm Group Vice Principal for Curriculum Support and Business Development. And that means that I'm responsible for looking after you as an applicant, helping you to make the right decision to choose Shrewsbury College's group, and also whilst you're a student here, making sure that you are looked after, you are able to travel and you are able to deal with any expenses that you have. As an applicant, we can help you find out about your travel options to Shrewsbury College's group. We're very proud that we support seven bus routes across the county to get into the college. They come from um, Powys, Welshpool, Oswestry, Bridge North, Ludlow, Market Drayton and Telford. For some people, using a college bus is the really great way to start college. It means that you're on a bus that absolutely is going to drop you off at the door, pick you up from the door. So if you're not very familiar with Shrewsbury and how to get around, it's a good way of finding your way about. You get to know people on the bus, you start to make friends on the bus, and it means that it can take away some of those anxieties about starting college. The college bus does run once in the morning and once again in the evening as a return journey. So it is something to consider if you're going to use the college bus that you will be here all day based on whatever your timetable is. You can use the learning resource centres and the social spaces around any lesson time to be getting on with work and obviously get involved in different enrichment activities. All of the details about the bus routes can be found on our website with each of the drop-off and pick-up points and the times that they currently run at. But if you have got any questions about those bus routes, then please get in touch with the student services team. The college bus routes are used with the bursary applicants as our first choice if anybody is eligible for the bursary, but we will consider other alternative routes on a case-by-case -case basis. You pay for the college bus on a termly basis and we do have some situations where we can support you for just using that for um, a, a reduced amount of time if that's appropriate. The other ways that college can help you with travel is to guide you onto the appropriate Arriva bus route that might be suitable from where you live. We can help you with purchasing um, termly passes, monthly passes and weekly passes for Arriva buses and you can use those for as many journeys as you want to during the week, the weekends and the evenings. Lots of information on our website about the different Arriva bus routes and again we can help you work out the best route for you if you get in touch with us. The other alternative that we have for travel which is really unique and very useful is that Shrewsbury College's group has got an agreement with Transport for Wales Trains and that agreement means that we have a 55% reduction on a normal student rail ticket which you can't get with any other institution and you can't get that without going through the college. So if you're thinking of travelling by train then make sure you talk to us and do your um, application for that through the college rather than going direct to Transport for Wales. Lots of our students use the trains really easily they come from um, Wolverhampton direction, from Ludlow direction, from um, Wem, and pick up the train routes very easily. The train passes are valid for one whole term, and again, you can use those weekends and evenings and during the half-term holidays, but they are only eligible up to the age of 18. So if you are a younger 18-year-old in terms of the academic year, then you won't get three full terms of it. But again, we can help you with information later on if you need that. If you're travelling by train and you're going to be based at the London Road campus then coming out of the train station and walking over the road to the bus station means that you can get on to an Arriva bus that comes out to London Road in time for your lessons and lots of students find that really easy. So there's lots of different choices for transport no right way, no wrong way, it's whatever suits you and you can always change your mind, start off on one route and one type of transport for term one and change that as the academic year goes on. We also recognise that some of you as applicants and students will also be travelling from areas like um, Ellesmere and Bishop's Castle where there are dedicated bus routes but not run by Arriva and we've spent a lot of time working with lakeside coaches and Minsterly Motors to agree a student pass if you're travelling on those. So again, you can only get that pass by doing it through the college, not direct to either of those bus companies. 
So hopefully you found that information useful around planning your journey into college. It is as important to plan your journey as it is to, to choose the right course. So make sure you're talking to us ahead. Make sure you're doing the application processes as you need to, and you'll get your passes sorted out well in advance for the start of the academic year. So please get in touch with Student Services if you've got any questions, or as I say, have a look at the website. But we look forward to seeing you soon.